Hello everybody, this is Pinstripe Paragon. Welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link to the Past. Last episode, we basically arrived here at the Dark Palace. And in this episode, we are going to be taking on the Dark Palace. Now, something I just want to mention, um, I'm well aware, actually, that, um, there are a lot of things that I could have done by now, um, but... I haven't done them yet. Quite frankly, it's because, you know, I'm not the best at this game, you know. I didn't exactly grow up with it. It's still a good game, though, but for some reason, I feel like I may have said that I grew up with it. I don't, like, earlier in the LP. I don't, I don't know, but <laughs> whatever. Um... So, I'm not going to, uh, like, get everything before you can. I mean, before you have to, you know. I mean, I know you can do that, <laughs> you know. Where you can get items before you're supposed to. Uh, I, I just don't. <laughs> I don't know, that's how I play the game, really. But let's, uh, talk to this. Link, can you hear me? It's me, Zelda. I am locked in Turtle Rock in another castle on top of Death Mountain. I know you were doing your best, but please hurry. Okay. So, speaking of uh, things you can get earlier, I, you could have upgraded bombs by now. I, and arrows, for that matter. I don't, just because I didn't bother with it when I could have, you know? So, oh well. But, anyway, on to this place. This is our first dungeon in the um, dark world pretty pretty dark I guess so these guys here I don't know if we faced them yet we I think I, I think we have but that might be because I had a failed recording of this here dungeon so yeah um anyway if we haven't faced them here's what I like to do I like to shoot an arrow get them to hit hit it by you know going the opposite way um it's a pretty decent strategy. There are definitely other ways you can take them out. Uh, I want to get that guy. Oh, my God. Yeah. Oh, dang it, Bobby. Oh, God. Yes. Oh, boy. Okay. Like, okay, now now it's all switched up on you. It goes forward instead of backward. And Oh, it's weird, but... Uh, all right. We got the dungeon map. Hmm. What the hell is this? Hmm. Well, can I hit it? No. Now, now some of these cracks in the wall. Um. Huh. That's that's odd. It gives a weird sound. Oh. Yeah. Okay. So it's a sound. I thought it was like something different with the uh, animation. So, cause like. A lot of the times when I play this game, I don't have the sound on. It's kind of weird, but yeah, whatever. And here are a bunch of fairies. Nice. I didn't know this before, because like my walk, the walkthrough I'm using right now doesn't exactly. Oh, well, okay. I should probably have that up instead of the recording screen, but I I didn't know those were there, so that's new for me. So that's how you get this. I must have known that at some point, because you can't. You have to get that in order to progress. I don't know. But, uh, yeah, that's how you know, um, like, which, which walls are breakable or not. Like, again, I'm not sure if, like, random walls are breakable, you know. I would just have to see, because, like, here. It's the same sound, so. I just wanted to point that out. Okay, so let's get on to the real parts of the dungeon. Again, fake. Um, anyway. On to the real parts of the dungeon. Um, yeah, once we get over here, we can go through this. I don't know why I can't come up with anything good to say, really. I don't know. Like, it's kind of been a long day, I guess. It hasn't necessarily been bad. Just been over relatively long some of you may know what I'm talking about. Ow. Like, you know, it's not a bad day, but it just seems like a long day, even though it's Friday. That, that might explain it, actually. But yeah, that's 
this won't be here if you just fall because we put the block down here and we got our another key i'm sorry if i'm not like explaining things like too in depth in this like it's just um this can be a pretty lengthy dungeon if you know you forget what to do so i'm just trying to you know go through this as fast as i can really because I want to get back to the overworld of the dark world, so then I can explore that a little more. Alright, let's use a bomb here. And now, we fall through the floor! Okay. So, yeah. I don't think any of those are breakable, really. You know, let me check my map. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing over there. Like, I'm sorry, but like, <laughs> the map I'm using is, isn't the best at all. Like... I have to zoom in a lot. And we've already got the big key. We're like, what, six minutes in? That's nice. Um, but that's this is the only way you can uh, get back. So, um, yeah. What have you guys been lately? It's been a while since I've recorded, actually. Um, I don't know if it has been a while, actually, or not. You know. Like, some days, you can never tell, like, how long it's been since you recorded. Is that just me? It might just be me. But, yeah, now that we've basically broken off that one area, we can't really use that right now. So, let's just use the other way. And we got these things. OMG. Uh, okay. So, obviously, we can't go through that top door, but we can go through this top door. Yay. Alright. Alright, so we got some tricksters here. Need to use the Pegasus boots. Really much. Okay. Head to here. And... Oh, it's dark and spooky. It's time for the lamp! Time to show the- Oh my god, dinos! It's time to show the darkness who's boss. Because we're Pajama Sam! Yeah! Because Pajama Sam is a point-and-click thing that flashes a bright yellow light at you. Do you- Nobody knows what I'm trying to reference, probably. Like, it's some point-and-click adventure game from, like, my childhood, basically. And, um, like, I I remember not being able to play the first one for a while because I just never found it anywhere. Like, like I was like, it's a, it's a child game, so don't, I wouldn't recommend it today at all, but whatever so how do I get over there damn it <laughs> I'm so confused <laughs> like I need a lamp that that can actually do stuff not just randomly put stuff on fire and then not do anything about it later oh my god freaking yeah. but like anyway so when I finally got around to playing that game um like I, I can't remember how old I was um I Oh, God, I really don't. Uh, and so... Like, one of the parts, he just, like, flashes a bright yellow light, and we get the magic hammer! Hammer time! Oh, God, I'm gonna have so much fun with this. Because I definitely want to be MC Hammer, you know, master of ceremonies and stuff. Yeah. I doubt a lot of my friends know what MC actually stands for, to be honest. Because, like, for one, I don't ask because I don't care, you know. But, like, they just seem to say, MC, and then stuff. But we have the compass. We have all the main dungeon items, so we're doing pretty good here. Um, Here, let me see. Well, now that we have the map. Oh, dang it. I keep hitting the wrong buttons, you know. Um, you know what? I want to head down there, actually. Just because... Just you know, I can do it in a little bit more of a chronological order. Actually, well, I guess you could. You could take on the boss right now, I think. I mean, here's an arrow, like, that's going to be useful. Okay, no, you cannot take on the boss because there is... It's blocked off, basically. And I really don't care about those rupees right now. I mean, I'll have my chance to get some more. But, well, now we know where we need to go, but the question is, how will we complete the journey? You know, 
And five rupees. Whoop did he Ooh, I get to move a statue. I wish you could make this this thing right here explode, you know. I mean it's going in there so fast, you know. It that would be funny. Oh uh, god. Let me think. Oh yeah, I haven't gone in this room yet, have I? Well I technically I have but I haven't done anything productive in there. So yeah, that's how you open that switch there without having to deal with those guys. Because Let's face it, nobody wants to deal with them. They're really annoying. Okay. So, what else is new? I need to record some more uh, co-ops with my friends. You know, like, at the time of recording this, uh, we're currently working on some Mario Party 2. And, uh, I mean, we've been really enjoying that, you know. Um... Even though we've only done two boards so far, you know, we, we've been having a blast doing it, so. Um, yeah. Expect some more with uh, my friends, so. Oh my god, freaking. Okay, just stand right there. And. Hit! Yes! It works! Hit! Yes! Alright. Full meter! Full meter! Okay. Um, freaking! Yes! Hit! Okay, let's wait. Hey, run! 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 Wait, okay. Run! 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 run. You, you know. I'm sorry I bumped the mic there. Like, it doesn't sound the same when you're talking into it and you bump it, you know, because you don't notice it. But you guys do. Trust me. You, you do. Try to be like ASCF moving there. Alright, so now that we have the hammer, we can take care of these guys and these weird turtle things. Nice! Two for one! Alright, let's see here. Alright, let's uh get the and let's just use a boomerang, save an arrow. <laughs> Alright, so let's head to the door! Because we unlocked the door and the door is Oh god! Freaking. Yeah. Yes. Indeed. Indeedly dumptious, scrumptious. Whatever that means. Okay. In this room, we have to take out pretty much all these weird turtles. I don't, are they turtles? You decide! Oh god, new! No. And. Woo! 20 rupee. Yes! And. Nice! That did it. Uh, I just want to light this up real fast. Just because, you know, it's nice, I guess. And some more. Even though it's completely not necessary. Wait, okay, which one? Which one moves? Which one moves? Oh my god, which one moves? Uh, it must be this one. Yes. Okay. And now, oh god. We are right here, outside of the boss. It's boss delicious. Did I seriously just say that? <laughs> wow. Oh my god! It's Godzilla! No, it's not Godzilla due to trade copyright marks and stuff. But still, we should really think it is Godzilla! <laughs> but it isn't. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so, oh god! These things here. Alright, so, there's a lot of strategies that you can do to take out, um,. What's this guy's name? Crap, I don't remember. I like to call him Godzilla! Just because I like to quote Austin Powers' gold member. That's just me, but... Yeah! Good move. V. It's okay, I got fairies! Right? Yeah. Now, come on. Why am I floating? Oh, floaty floats float! Oh, God. Frickin... Oh, God. No! Oh no, okay. Time to bring out the big guns! Arrows! Yeah. Ow! You frickin' fricker. Oh god! It's not friendly! Okay, I still have another fair. Three. I better not die! For good! You know, that all be bad. Like, I don't know. Do potatoes! Nice! All I needed was one arrow, and it's done. Yay! Alright. So, 
Got ourselves a full bar of life. Now, we, we could have had that full bar sooner. It, it, I just decided to, you know, hold off on that for a little while. But we got a crystal! Oh, boy! Save a crystal! Hey, Origins! And... Hello! Link, because of you, I can escape from the clutches of the evil monsters. Thank you. This world used to be the golden land where the Triforce was hidden. But because Ganon, the boss of the thieves, wished it the world was transformed, I'm sure he's intending to conquer even our light world after building his power here. Oh no! He is trying to open a larger gate between worlds near the castle using our powers. But the gate is not open completely yet. If we seven maidens come together, we can break the barrier around Ganon's hiding place. I will tell you where the other girls are held. I believe you will destroy Ganon. I will return to my form, original form at that time. Do you understand? Yes! May the way of the hero lead the Triforce. The way of the hero. What's the way of the hero? Will we find out next time? I doubt it. Uh, anyway, the next episode of Let's Play Legend of Zelda Link to the Past, we will be exploring more of the overworld of the dark world. So, yeah, it's going to be pretty interesting. So, thank you guys for watching, and I'll see you guys next time. Ow.